Man United and England footballer Mason Greenwood should be allowed to move forward and revive career, says his team. Manchester United footballer Mason Greenwood should be allowed to move forward and revive his career, his team have claimed. Charges of attempted rape and assault were dropped against the United forward last month. The 21-year-old, who has made more than 100 appearances for his boyhood club, was arrested in January 2022 amid allegations surrounding images and videos that were shared on social media. Greenwood, who has won cap for England, was later charged with attempted rape, controlling and coercive behavior and assault occasioning actual bodily harm. In early February 2023, the Crown Prosecution Service said the charges were discontinued after key witnesses withdrew their involvement and new material came to light. Following the announcement, Manchester United said they would conduct their own investigation before determining next steps, having suspended the player from playing or training within hours, or the initial allegations. It was reported last month that United would wait until the summer to make a final decision on Greenwood's future, with the striker more likely to leave than to remain at Old Trafford. Some European clubs have already expressed interest in signing Greenwood, with Manchester United believed to have rejected offers from Turkey as the club's internal investigation continue. A United player or not, Greenwood's team believe he should get the opportunity to rebuild and move forward with his young life. A representative of the player told The Athletic, Mason is 21, he has been cleared and should be allowed the opportunity to rebuild and move forward with his young life. Greenwood is also believed to be desperate to revive his career, with a source telling The Athletic that he would run through a brick wall to be back on the pitch for Manchester United. In other news, Man United said to make second iconic shirt number available as Eric Ten Hag patience runs out. It recently emerged that Anthony Marshall's days at Manchester United are numbered, with Eric Ten Hag ready to sell the striker at the end of the season. The France international has been at the club ever since arriving from Monaco back in 2015, often blowing hot and cold in the years that have followed. Should he leave, the No-9 shirt will be on the market, one worn by Red Devils legends of years gone by. Manchester United thought Marshall would be a future Ballon d'Or winner when they paid £36 million to land him during Louis van Gaal's time in the dugout. His 17 goals during the 2015-2016 suggested he'd been money well spent, with the France international propelling the club to fuck up glory. But while Marshall has had his moments in a red shirt, he's never scaled the dizzying heights many expected at the time of his arrival. It recently emerged that Ten Hag was fed up of the 27-year-old's ongoing injury problems. Marshall was given a chance to prove himself at the beginning of the season, impressing on the club's pre-season tour of Thailand and Australia. With United having other priorities, they opted to welcome him back into the fold despite a poor loan spell at Sevilla last term. Marshall initially looked to have turned a corner, netting in matches against Manchester City, Ammonia and Everton at the beginning of the season, but he's been regularly sidelined ever since and has made just four appearances since the turn of the year. It's no wonder United are looking for somebody they can rely on on a weekly basis, with Harry Kane and Victor Osimhen two players on their radar. Should the France international leave, then the No-9 shirt will become vacant. While not as prestigious as the No-7, it's still a jersey that has been occupied by many club legends in the past. Andy Cole did it justice during his period becoming one of England's finest ever strikers and propelling United to the treble back in 1999. He struck up a formidable partnership with Dwight York, with Ole Gunnar Solskjaer and Teddy Sheringham also members of that successful squad. Zlatan Ibrahimovic lived up to the hype upon moving on a free transfer from Paris Saint-Germain in 2016, firing the Red Devils to Europa League in Carabao Cup glory. Dimitar Berbatov was a hit, with the Bulgaria international winning two league titles after moving from Tottenham in 2000. If you enjoyed the video make sure to smash the like button and make sure to subscribe to Man United Hub to get all the all the latest updates.